First on Sunday and then on, on Monday, the global mean temperature has reached a new record that has exceeded the record set by the record-breaking year of 2023. So we are in uncharted territory. And in you know, likelihood, especially if you look at the uh, average over the year, this is probably the last 12 months have been the warmest 12 months in the last 100,000 years or thereabout. And what is driving it on one hand is the ocean, um, because the ocean is still a very, very warm. And more importantly, um, what's happening in Antarctica. So a good part of Antarctica is much warmer than usual. And so when you sum that up into the global average, this actually um, drives the average up. Now, if our goal is to keep, as we promised in the international agreement set in Paris in 2015, to keep the global temperature below 2 degrees and aspire to keep it below 1.5, well, this is not a good news. With this warming that we have seen and that in all likelihood will continue in the next few months and, and years, well, we are approaching that limit. And, and so it becomes more and more urgent, if that's our goal, to limit the emission of greenhouse gases uh, to, if, if, if we want to maintain the planet within that boundary.